So do I just sit here now? Oh, I've kept the leaf. I've double jumped still. And my air dashes. I'm just a cat now for no good reason. I mean, I'm actually much faster. <gasps> Which is why the, all those little platforms were there. The little gaps I could get into. Oh, I'm so cl- Oh no! I killed the kitty! I am the worst person. So, did I actually kill her or did she just turn to a cat? Because, lol. I, I don't know what's happening anymore. One minute I was a cat and the next I'm not a cat. I mean, I'm not complaining. I love cats. They're adorable. But ivory... But what are the ivory bugs? Are they just like skull tullers? Everything's all ominous. I mean, what happened with Lubella? I could go through here now. And avoid all the damages. I got the cat sphere. What does that do? Also, it's in cat. What? Are we just. Are we not explaining this now, I guess? I guess we're just not going to explain this anymore. I mean, I'm not complaining, but. It's still really random. So we can. I not go past the Libella had me before then? I'm actually much faster in cat form, I guess. I can't jump as high. I'm assuming that's the downside. And I can't find my bow anymore. So... I'm seeing nothing but positives here, guys. I must say. Let's go back to where when Bella took us out, because... So random. Cat form. We're not going to explain it. Just roll with it, that shit. I guess. They take the same amount of damage. Kind of nice. Which it doesn't really change much. Why a cat? This is the memorial park, so Whitleaf is probably the person who died on that one grave, I'm gonna guess. Feels like they just threw it in at this point, just to have the cat element. Better rename me Nidley, because I'm going mid. I, I, hey, Panda Woman, do you know about me turning into a cat? No? Great. Better keep motoring then, I guess. So are you going to attack me again? Now I'm going to darn some spikes. Truly her traps are the most outrageous. Oops. Yeah, there's nowhere I can really go from here. This is just a dead end designed for me to turn into a cat. I, I guess that makes sense. What? Huh? Where, where on the map can I go? That's a dead end. That's a dead end. So it's just, I guess, go back. The weird grave site I found. Yeah, sure, why not? Not like there's anything else that can be done. What if I went to the witch with all the cats in cat form? Would that trigger anything? If she likes cats, then she's a witch. I mean, forgive my racism with the whole witch and cat thing. But I think that makes complete sense. Okay, so... Has this changed? Nope, not in cat form. I just love how I extend my body, actually, when I do the cat leap. It's like I'm pouncing. 
Oh, cute little kitty pouncing. Still able to rip anyone who comes across them in two, though. They, just, they don't explain the cat sphere. That's even weirder. It's like, oh yeah, it's a magic sphere that lets you turn back from cat form. Where'd it come from? Who knows? Is it gonna work for you? You bet your briefs it will. Oh, I'm so much slower in the water. I'm Aqua Kitty. No one is prepared for Aqua Kitty. I mean, maybe the cat witch left down here. I guess that makes sense. So we need to go across from here. And we can jump to here now, because we can jump higher as a kitty. But it does nothing, because it's still a trap door. Then what was even the point? Yeah, hitting it doesn't change anything. Aqua Kitty. Oh, I do a little roll. Look at that kitty roll. Apologies when my voice goes high. It's it's cats, let's be fair. There is now zero danger from being hit by this. It's like an underwater kitty playground. All these fish. How can you resist? I love how all my commentary is completely de derailed for this one cat. They knew, they knew by this point we'd be getting fed up and they're just like, here, have a cat. We got a dirty shroom. Uh, what dirty shroom do? It's leaking some slimy white substance. Imp girls are fond of it. Okay. I guess that feels dirty. Why would it be the key items? No sense. Don't want to burn the kitty. We can sneak through areas now. I just, I don't understand where I'm meant to be going. Looks like there's a place over here, so let's get out of cat form. So we don't immediately kill ourselves. Don't get me wrong, it's adorable, but I'm very uncontrollable in this form. How could the bats hurt the kitty? Is this the room with the way up? Yeah. It looks like root up, which is here. Oh, it was hardly hidden, was it? Whenever I'm in human form, I will be serious and absolutely amazing. When I'm in cat form, all conversation ceases to exist as we know it. So here's where I was in the cat cage earlier. It's a boss, isn't it? Oh boy! Is that still going to be coming through here? Derelict Breeder. Um, hi, I guess? Oh, thank god she came into the room. I was about to say, this would have been completely broken. Oh, am I going to have to transform into cat form to escape the beam? That looks like how it's going to go. Okay, round two, you derelict breeder. Whatever that means. So we attack, and we turn into a cat whenever he does the beam. I guess it's a he. Okay, it's probably a she, because the cat lady thing. Ready? Oh, they do have attacks. I thought it was just the beam. They turn to the cat. Get down! The cat form does nothing. Round three. You 
transformed. What's her attack pattern? All I'm seeing is just you moving. Okay, so it's the beam I can't tell when it's coming. But I'll take damage no matter what because of all damage. Um, contact damage. I think I've just got to fight in cat mode. I think that's the only way to win this. But I can't heal when I'm in cat mode, though. So I've got to kind of balance out cat mode in real mode. I guess I'll have to figure that out next time. See ya.